there's been a lot of eras throughout YouTube's history, you know? The Niga Higa era, the Smosh era, the unfunny Smosh era, the, the, the super unfunny Smosh era where their corporate overlords made them keep reproducing the same uninteresting themed videos which caused one of the literal co-founders of Smosh to leave? Yeah, but, but nothing comes close to how exciting disorderly and downright scary the commentary era was you know on one hand it was a gold rush an absolute gold rush it, it was no man's land everyone was running around trying to be the next leafiest here because as long as you had a microphone and the ability to stretch out a two minute topic for 10 minutes you too could become a youtube celebrity now on the other hand the commentary community were like goddamn hounds fighting over the scraps of mundane topics available to be milked for internet clout no one was safe Oh, oh you, you, you're some cringy ass kid talking about how much you like Pokemon Go? Get that nigga! Get, get him before he escapes! It didn't matter who you were or what you did. If one of them made a video on something, you can guarantee that there'd be 70,000 more videos about the same thing in the same format, with the same title, with the same exact talking points. And that's when their audience, their five to six year old kindergarten council audience, held a meeting. And <laughs> It was at this time, the commentary era was slowing down, you know? Subscribers were leaving out the doors in herds, their YouTube channel views were plummeting. It seemed as if this was it, as if this was the end. It was all over for commentary channels. But then, something miraculous happened. S something no one could have ever expected. Jake Paul and Logan Paul entered the YouTube scene. It was an economy boom. The amount of cringe produced by these two brothers alone allowed channels to not only make one boring as hell video each on the same topic, but two whole boring as hell videos on the same exact topic. If you were a commentary channel back then and you were creating li literal biographies about the Paul brothers, good luck feeding your family. Because the moment Jake Paul or Logan Paul so much as tied the laces on their shoes, there'd be a barrage of 10 minute videos explaining why they're idiots and need to be taken off of YouTube. And though these vermin, I, I, I mean commentary channels, were, were at the peak of their existence and joined their newfound source of income, it wouldn't be for long. Something was coming. Someone was coming. Idubs, the lord of memes, lord of demolishing channels reputations, he made a content cop on the god of commentary channels, Leafy, and it was embarrassing. Aw oh, man. It, it, it was it was absolutely embarrassing. And that 20 something minute video, Idubs dismembered Leafy. He took him apart, piece by piece, made fun of his channel, his content, his hideous characteristics. Long story short, Idubs making fun of Leafy put all commentary channels into panic mode. People are going around self-destructing, deleting their commentary YouTube channels in fear that Idubs, the holy savior, would come for them and cleanse them because of their sins. With that content cap, Idubs made commentary content uncool to the YouTube community. And if you were caught making that shit on your channel, consider yourself a target. From then on, we'd see less and less commentary channels and content being made. Shortly after, instead of just waiting for the hate to subside, Leafy, the symbol of the commentary era, couldn't take all the hate he was getting and just quit. And sadly, as the symbol of the era had left, so did the era itself. This was it. The end of the commentary era. Nowadays in 2020, there's still some commentary channels around us, hiding in the shadows, living on the bottom, picking up any scraps they can find for their next meal. Even though their content is still pretty garbage, they live on in our hearts as pioneers of a previous era. For now, they must live in silence. But one day, oh, just, just, just maybe one day, their king will return and all hell will break loose on this site once again. <laughs>